All right, Chris. Hey, man. It's it's two thirty in the morning, and I just saw your video. Um, it's too long, so I couldn't stitch it or uh, do a duet or anything like that. So I, I didn't come from the same kind of background that you did. Um, I didn't start live streaming until it was on Twitch, um, and I, I'm still not a big streamer or whatnot. Um, I only have maybe. 200 or so followers on Twitch. I've got about a thousand, 1400 or so on TikTok. Your question, and you're talking about um, what do you do when there's nobody in chat? And it's a little different for a gamer, a little bit different. Um, when you're playing a game and there's nobody in chat, you don't just talk to yourself. What you do is you dictate what is happening in the game, you talk about what you're doing. So the first thing you have to do is you've really got to find something that you want to do in the game. And that should go for any gamer when you're streaming at all. You need to have a purpose. You need to have, say, for, for this day, I'm going to plan out, I'm going to do this, 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 and this. This is what I'm going to do in this game. If it's like an MMO, like what I do, I can do my daily quest, I can do a dungeon, I can do this or that, I can do some crafting or whatnot, I can do some advertising for my guild, it doesn't matter. I can I find things to do. And as I'm doing those things, I just say, I'm going to walk over here, I'm going to talk to this guy, let me see what's going on here, do 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 do, oh, okay, yeah, I'm done with that, man, I'm going to craft a sword. Man, it's a lot of swords right there. Hmm, anybody in chat have any idea of what's, what's, your, what's your favorite sword? They don't have to be there. I just asked them what's your favorite sword because I don't know <laughs> maybe I can clip that later and put it on TikTok and say what's your favorite sword you know I just come up with things that I can ask people later on in my stream and that's something that I can clip that's something that I can turn into a TikTok that's something that I can better interact with my viewers and turn them back to my Twitch account back to my streams so they can go on and say hey man I heard about what your favorite sword was. I heard about what your favorite, favorite build was. And let me talk to you about that. Awesome. Awesome stuff there. I like that your whiteboard is so full because you are doing just chatting. That's a lot more difficult and I commend you for that. Because you, you have nothing but you to present there. Nothing but your own interests, your own ideas, your own topic of conversation as a radio host. That's got to be very difficult because you're trying to find things to do and to talk about. And you have to have something interesting to draw the audience in. It's different from a video game because the video game itself does that all for you. But anyways, I want to ask you, what are some tips you can have for video game guys that you have learned as a radio guy?